Hi everyone, welcome again. This is Raju Mathu. On my last videos, I have shown you how can we append rows at the bottom of a table, and also we have seen how can we add section and also how can we append section at the bottom of a table. So today I am going to show you how can we remove all the rows present on a table. So as like as the other videos or other demos. So here we have a view at the bottom top of the table and uh, having a button so now i will modify the existing code slightly so that on click of this button we will remove all the rows present on the table so for that let's modify the our view so as per the ui we have the view at the top uh, which having a button so on click of this button i will need to remove all these rows present or defined on this table view so for that let's modify rename this on click function of this button so i am going to change it as a remove rows now definitely i need to define this function on the related index so let's define the function here remove rows now to remove all the rows present on the table titanium provides properties that is called data which is used to assign rows uh, in a bulk to a table and also they have uh, provided the function method associated with the table view called set data which is also used to add rows in a bulk or or a single rows in a table so i will add the same function here or the same property here to remove all the rows present on the table so to do that let's call the table here first so as we have already defined the index id property of the table so i will call the table or i will catch that table with that id property of the table so here it is the here it is the table so now i need to remove all the rows so to do that i will call the method set data which is generally used to define or the to assign rows so i will do the same here but with a blank array so here it is now let's run our application we can also use the property data property associated with the table to remove all the rows from the table so let's see the first using the method set data then again i will show you the same thing using that property data property so here it is so now on click of this button sorry i have mm, i didn't change the button title here so forgive me for that so now on click of this button the all the rows should get removed so here i am going to click on this so here you can see that on click of this button all the rows get removed from the table so on the same way let's call the use the property data property to get remove the rows from the table so before that i am changing the button text here it's annoying as it is defined as a type add so i am going to change it as a remove rows and increasing the width with 100 now on the same way let's comment it and let's i am going to use the table data property to remove table rows so 
here it is data which is generally used to append the rows on the table uh, sorry the app adding the rows assigning the rows to the table so on the same way I am adding the blank array list so that it will remove all the data replace all the data by this blank array blank array list so here again I am saving it and going for running the application on the simulator so here you can see that the same function or the same property which is used to display or which is used to add the data on table can be used similar way to remove the rows from the table so here on click of this button you should remove the these all rows from this table so here it is that's it so on my next video i'm going to show you how can you remove or delete the specific row on from the table so up to this for today thanks